talk about the, the ongoing headache about the Olympic Games, and you've got a $25,000 event in France that's completely and utterly packed and round. I mean, the people were queuing up 40 minutes before the actual women's final outside. I mean, we could barely get through. Yeah, it's absolutely amazing. I mean, I remember those days back at Wembley for the British Open, people in the, in, in the peak, like yeah, the 80s. Oh, it's a nice change of direction. That's something that Greg Lark we need to do. We said it with Tom Richards last night against Chris Simpson, slightly holding it and then switching it across his body. Those situations, he, he has to kind of eradicate Parkey. All the momentum is with him and he's working so hard. He doesn't want to give away cheap points like that. Slightly overexcited. The, and that is wow. a chop suey. It was a weak cross court and that was lethal for Chris Simpson. Rightly, rightly put away, Parkey hit. Yeah, it certainly was. He's very, Five, very good on that backhand six. side and that was wonderful technique for Simpson. Flat as a crep. That's good defensive work from Chris Simpson. Oh, he's another got perfect wit. Wow. That was immense width. If he was playing the shoe game, which is the shoe game when you hit into length, I mean, that was bang on there. Six that would have been ball. two points, but only one in PS8. So, <laughs> four game balls for Gregoire Marsh in this first game. He's got him. Whoa! Ferocious wit. So the crowd go crazy, the feet banging, the head slapping at each other. Well, that boast is now starting to cause a bit of problem, a few problems for Chris Simpson. That's a good shot from Simpson. Look at the mobility of the Frenchman. Terrific line hitting there. Oh, that's, that is back to the quality rally that we've see, seen from Gregoire Marsh in this event, particularly last night in the first game here. That will give him some uh, confidence once again. Three, but it stemmed from the line and length to the back of the court. Junior's watching, it's very good balance and stayed down, committed to the shot. Uh, a little bit of applause, nice to see from Gregoire Marsh. It was uh, a wonderful backhand straight Nine, folly five. and then the finish there on the four. Just won't go away here, Marsh. It's very frustrating. Nearly slipped again. He's, uh, it's going to be a let ball. Decision Marsh. Be yeah, he's been knocked off balance. There's enough contact there. No let. Wow. Oh. That was a horrendous no. decision. Well, you can see really that he's fully knocked off balance. That's uh, a dreadful decision. It really is. I understand that. It's a great Simpson shot from Simpson there. He slips on the recovery. Quite a lot of contact there. Well, it's it's hard. Can you see it again? You think, well. Please. But I mean, he must be furious and he's got to forget about that. But Chris Simpson was blowing really, really hard in that on that camera picture. He'd be relieved as anything to get the no let. So it's now one game all in this final England France. That shot really well, Chris Simpson on the backhand. Down. So accurate. Yeah, well, that was your diagonal corners, backhand back corner, forehand front. Hand out, two, three. Lovely open racket face. It's well lifted from Mark. Reason. I can't believe this. Ra the rallies are just going on and on and on. It's such good quality, Parky. So high quality, such high quality. Yeah, it's very impressive. Very really impressive is indeed. Impressive. And it still goes on. Either the way this goes, even if Simpson wins it, the crowd have got to give it some. Oh. Slightly lucky bounce for Simpson. He'll be relieved. Gregor Marsh bending over, feeling it. Chris Simpson doing well to try and hide his discomfort physically. This is the real nitty gritty now. So when the physicality of the game Five. starts.
down. Another unforced error from Chris Simpson. The crowd off their seats. But stopping once again. Gregoire Marsh puts himself in a very good position in this final. That's just an unbelievable no. pickup from Marsh. He's again pickup. having to play another shot there, Chris Simpson. What was good? Go lower and lower against this French acrobat. Three. Well, it is the, uh, like I say, the Canary Wharf court. It's a brand new back wall, Parky. You just said from our camera there, it's got less fins to stabilize. So I don't know if they've just been, uh, back wall's been fitted there. Uh, well, it's tagged to the floor, but uh, for reason. I've got, wow, I mean, that is, surely the stand is going to uh, Seven, collapse. One. Well, you I mean, can see the camera was, wobbling oh, there. Just, well, he looks as fresh as a daisy, doesn't he? Yeah, he's just one of those Ribena berries. That's what he reminds me of. There are other set yeah, drinks available. This Wow. Send a magnifique from uh, Gregoire. What a stylish way to finish. What a performance throughout this event for Gregoire Marsh. Unbelievable semi last night. And even a better final. Thoroughly deserved for the French number three. And there's the uh, Mini light celebration. 77 minutes of world class, top quality squash. Gregoire Marsh, the number four seed, taking another scalp, this time in the form of Chris Simpson. 11 6, 8 11, 11 6, 11 2. Three games to one.